Will this be on the test? That phrase can tell you a lot about innovation in your organization. We're going to have a conversation about that today. You may be wondering, who is this guy? My name is Ken Okel. I am a keynote speaker, and I talk to audiences about ways you can improve your performance on the job. I share insider knowledge from my time spent in broadcast news, hurricane relief, and professional ballet. Now, whoa. I know, it is an unusual combination, but here's the thing. In each and every field, I had to perform at a high level every day under pressure. Do you remember when people would ask that question, will this be on the test? I heard it in high school. I heard it in college. When a professor is talking about some information, but maybe it's outside what you normally would be learning. So someone would raise their hand and say, will this be on the test? And if the teacher said no, suddenly you saw people drop their pens and pencils or power down their laptops because they thought, well, I don't need to hear this if we're not going to be tested on it. But they never thought, gee, why is the professor telling me this information? And could I learn something from that person that maybe we're not going to be tested on, but it's still good information to know? Why am I telling you about this? Because sometimes in organizations, well, I see situations where people say, oh, we're going to be innovative and learn, but their minds aren't open to receiving new information, especially if they don't think it's part of their job or on the test. You want people to be curious about things, say, tell me more instead of Will this be on the test? Now, maybe it doesn't apply to their world, to their jobs, but do people have a mindset of there's still more I can learn? Or are they like, I only need to know this if I need to know this, and I'm the one who's making the call? If that's the case, you may have an innovation issue and don't expect a lot of new ideas. Leave, will this be on the test? Back in your school age days, be curious. For more about me, go to my website, kenokel.com. While there, you can watch some video clips of my speaking presentations, you can read some of my articles, and you can listen to my podcast, The Two Minute Takeaway, all at kenokel.com. Like this video? Well, then go ahead and like and subscribe. We've got some great content coming up. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Ken Okel. Take care.